Last time on Alpaca Patrol Plays FTL, he unlocked the Slug Cruiser. That's right, the Slug Cruiser. By the way, hello anybody, I am Alpaca Patrol, and this is FTL, faster than light. Um, and now we have uh, the Slug Cruiser unlocked, which seems pretty cool. What do we got? An oh, intriguing. Anti-bio beam, a dual shot laser, and a breach bomb. Very intriguing indeed. I only start with two crew members. Alright, let's look at this. While using Slug Cruiser, have vision of every room of the enemy ship without functioning sensors. How are you supposed to do that? I don't... Like... Huh. Is it just that? So we just have to have sensors down. That, that should be easy. Uh, jump to 30 nebula locations before Sector 8. Maybe. Uh, kill three enemy crew members with one shot from the anti-bio beam. Also possible. Okay, so this is doable, and we have the uh, the man of war here. All right, so let's uh, let's rename it to the USS. Uh, what does this kind of look like? Kind of looks like a nutsack to me. So we're gonna call it the USS Scrotum O Doom. The USS Scrotum Doom. Here we go, guys. We're ready. Oh, a slug repair drill. Drill. Uh, slug ship with six six gel that automatically repairs any hull breaches. Wow, that's really awesome. Uh, actually, that's a, that's a really great thing for us. So that's good. Okay, so we definitely want to power up our engines. We can power down our med bay. Power these up. Ah, not quite. I see. Interesting. Well, we can power down the breach bomb for now and then rely on the dual laser because that's probably enough for right now. Um, and we want to get to ne nebula beacons, right? So let's uh, let's do that. And we're trying to aim for nebulas. Okay, distant sun. Bummer. Uh, and we want to get to 30. We're, we're trying to at least unlock uh, a thing. We don't have sensors, actually, now that I think about it. Okay, intervene and defend the outpost. Uh, no sense in having the bio beam up. Um, so we're going to fire the dual laser at their uh, <coughs> weapon system and then uh, fire that at whatever else is necessary, which I don't know what will be necessary. Yeah, I mean, now that they're... Ion Blast is down, we can pretty much just win by way of our dual laser. But I'll make sure the weapons go down. Okay, now I'll hit them in the pilot room so that we don't have to concern ourselves with, um, uh, with, with fangs, uh, with missing. Wow, they have a level 2 pilot room, really? Okay, so we don't have sensors, which, I, you know, I don't know how you could see the entirety of the enemy ship without functioning sensors. Is that, is that just supposed to mean that... Uh, you're supposed to keep, like, get sensors and power them down? Is that the idea? I'm really not sure, to be honest. Uh, we're gonna hit their shields again because, I mean, they're powering up this beam, but it can't penetrate our shields anyway, so, I mean, you know, it's not really a big concern. I believe that's a mini beam, too, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, their shields should be down. Now we can hit them in the weapons again. And, uh, even though this fight took a while, um, went pretty well. Went pretty easily, I'd have to say. Definitely a good first fight for us. Uh, cool. Did they give us a missile? What did they give us? Did they just give us some stuff. Okay, cool. I thought I thought I had read missile there for some reason. Anyway, we'll move on. Jump to this other nebula beacon. I hope we don't encounter any ion storms, but uh, we may. Okay, they're charging their FTL drive. That sucks. Uh, but we're going to use a breach missile to attack their... Uh, actually, that's not going to do anything, is it? Does breach do damage? Requires does one damage to systems. Okay, yes. So we're gonna use that there. Uh, then we're gonna turn off the breach missile. We're just making sure that they don't uh, <coughs> get away because they're charging their FTL drive. Uh, I wanted to deal with their. Um, it was kind of a waste of a missile, kinda. Uh, but I, I didn't want to. I wanted to take down their missile system and also not worry about them getting away. So I think it was worth it. I mean, we did take two damage from the missile. We probably would have taken another two damage if we hadn't done so. Can this jump places? Yeah, I can. Okay, cool. So let's go here. Yeah, that is, like, the best feature in the game, I have to say. Okay. Uh, let's manually search the wreckage. Cool, we got five missiles. Extra scrap. Excuse me, I'm not crying. I'm not, like, tearing up. Uh, I just, I, like, kind of burped and, and also... Uh, okay. Okay. Okay, alright, so we're gonna get the breach bomb up, we're gonna get that up, we're gonna get oxygen up, definitely, because we kind of need that. Um, and then we're gonna hit them in their weapons. And what kind of drones do they have? I don't know, I'm not sure. We are gonna save the breach bomb, probably, um, we're probably not gonna use it right now. Yeah, because one of their whole lasers is down, which means that we're pretty much good. 
Uh, where's my water? I need it! I need my water! I just got it, guys. Crisis averted. We have defeated their water. I apologize if that's loud. It is ice water. Um... Okay, well, you know what? We're gonna fire a breach bomb right on there. And we're gonna miss! Okay, great. Well, that's gonna hit. Uh, great. Go right for our oxygen again, I guess. Alright. We need another crew member, I'll say that. We definitely need another crew member. I'm gonna hit them in the shields again... now. Okay. Cool. Now their weapons are down, and I feel safe. But we're gonna keep hitting them in their, uh... in their, uh... weapon system. Okay, they want to give us four fuel, drone parts, scrap. Nah. Piracy is never forgiven. We must take care of them. No, no, no. Ah, oh, I didn't want to do that. Well, that works. It's fine. Uh, I actually wanted to fire my dual laser. But that's cool. Whatever. We'll fire the dual laser here. We kind of wasted a missile there. They could have given us four fuel, which would have been nice, but early on, not as valuable. I prefer the extra scrap, uh, to be honest. Okay. Cool. We got almost as much fuel. Uh, which is good. And we could kind of jump ahead here. Try to get to some other beacons. Because I like getting the other beacons. We're not using the bio beam. We should probably do that. Uh, cool. We're definitely not going to deal with them. Oh. Farts. This, uh, okay. Huh. How are we going to do this? Did he go to our med bay? Yeah, he did. Okay. Um, that's a big issue. So we're going to get into the med bay, then we're going to vent all the rooms so that that breach doesn't fucking kill us. Uh, and then we are going to deal with them like so. And we're going to miss with the fucking breach bomb, which is miserable. Um, but here's what we're going to have to do. We're going to have to use a breach bomb on their, on their drone control. Okay, it's off. That's good. So we're going to use a breach bomb there. Uh, it's kind of a waste of, uh, of bomb stuff, but not so much. Okay, now we can get the dual laser going there. By the way, uh, in case you didn't know, the slugs, we can see where the enemy crew is, uh, which is nice. Um, and I think our slug actually dealt with the whole, uh, med bay disaster, which is nice. We're gonna hit him in the shields. Okay, so crisis averted. We've dealt with it. We had to waste some lasers, uh, or missiles, rather, but, um... Okay, and they want to give us a slave. Fantastic, I will take a slave. Uh, forthwith. I would love to have buy, bought a slave, but you know what? Uh, beggars can't be choosers. We can't jump there, can we? No, we can't. Okay, so we'll jump over here uh, and try to get to that shop, see what we can't buy. Uh, who knows? Uh, I kind of want to upgrade a bit. No, we're going to reject their offer. What a what kind of offer is that? It's not an offer we're going to take, I'll tell you that much buddy. I eh, will use one breach bomb. Kind of unnecessary. But I don't want to deal with that beam. Yeah, that beam would have hurt. And I don't like beams. I'm not a fan of the beams, really, uh, to be honest with you. So, uh, we're just gonna deal with that. Uh, we're gonna hit them in the... We're gonna hit them in the pilot room. The reason we're gonna hit them in the pilot room is because uh, now the next shot is gonna hit. Uh, no matter what. Even if they get their shields back online. Uh, the next shot should kill them. So, we win. Fantastic. Got some fuel, drone parts. Cool. Let's go to the store, see what we can't get. I kind of want to buy um, a weapon. Drones, interesting. Sensors, also interesting. Now, I don't know, does that mean that I have to buy sensors and put them down in order to get the Type B? I really don't know. Oh, that's what happened. The slug repair gel dealt with that whole breach. Okay, interesting. Cool. Um, I guess we'll get sensors, right? I mean, yeah. I, I don't I don't know how that thing works, so we're, we're gonna get sensors. We'll get sensors. I mean, sensors are never really a bad idea necessarily to have. Um, and then we'll try to upgrade here something. Oh, we already have blast doors, which is nice. Engines, shields. Okay, so we'll, we'll, we'll consider what we're gonna do. Let's, uh, let's just jump around a bit. Where are we going? Okay, that, that sounds reasonable. That is doable. Uh, let's scrap the debris. I don't, I don't want to worry about our crew dying miserably or something. Can that get back to the exit? Mm. 
We may be in a dangerous boat here, but uh, I think I want to get to this distress beacon. Okay, it was a trap. Not a big deal. Not a big deal at all. Whole laser can hurt us, so we'll probably use a breach bomb on their old uh, shields there. And it missed. God, what is, does the breach bomb have like low like hit chance or something? Because it always seems to miss. I don't, uh, I don't quite understand, but that's fine. Whatever. Okay, great. Uh, we'll keep the breach bomb charged for now, and deal with the rest of that. Let's drop it right now. Okay, great. Um, breach bomb is a great weapon, by the way. Uh, but you know, there's uh, we we do have to hit in order to make it effective. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna hit them in their pilot room. Okay, there's a fire in their weapon room, which is good. Makes my life a little bit easier. Uh, then we're gonna hit them in their shields, which shouldn't miss. And I kind of want to power up our um, our bio beam and try to take them out that way. But I don't know if that's the best idea. Okay, so we're definitely gonna hit them in their weapons again. I don't know if I like this ship. It's okay, I guess. But meh, you know, it's all right. It's all right. It's not my it's not my favorite ship. I'll say that. Definitely not my favorite ship so far. Um, what is my favorite ship? I don't know. I'm not sure. Well, they're dead, pretty much, uh, in about a second here. They're trying to piece it, but there's nothing that they could do about it. Uh, <coughs> and, uh, yeah, that should be the end for them. Cool. Got some fuel, some missiles, some scrap. We may not make it here, which kind of sucks, but, uh, you know, we took that chance. Okay, nothing going on there. We aren't going to make it. That's a bummer. That really is quite a bummer. But let's get to this dress beacon. Maybe we'll get some extra scrap and then, uh, you know, deal with whatever it is that we have to deal with. Let's try to dislodge the ship. Didn't work. Okay, let's fight some rebels, which is not fun. But uh, we'll try to jump out, really. Because you don't really get anything by fighting these guys. Oh, good teleporters. Huzzah. Okay, so where's he going? He's going to go in there. Let's try to suffocate him a bit. Uh, let's get the dual lasers going on their weapons. Let's get the breach bomb going on their shields. And then we should be able to take them out. Maybe this will do a little bit of damage before he comes in here. Okay, oxygen's down. That is a big deal. Uh, so we're going to have to get a slug on in there to repair that. Okay. Success is being had. They keep getting our oxygen, which I don't know what the hell their deal is. Why they want our oxygen so bad. Great. There's a breach bomb or a breach in there, which sucks. Uh, our weapons are down. Okay, good. We can hit them in their shields. Oxygen's up. Slug repair gel is working on that hull breach, which is nice. Uh, and then we're going to try to jump out of here once we get the chance, which is very shortly here. Uh, let's open up all the doors. Okay, get in there to repair. And jump on to the next sector. Because basically what happens is, um... Oh, fuck yeah. We're gonna have to deal with Mantis, but we're getting to Nebula Beacon, so... I think we could get at least one of these achievements. So that's good. Um... Cool. The weapons should be online now. Indeed they are. Cool. Uh... Breach Bomb... Eh. Can I get this yet? No, I need uh, need more power. Actually, no, I, ha I have enough now. Level 2 shields, cool. That's good. I will take level 2 shields. Damn it, there is no nebula beacons in this sector. That's a bit of a bummer, to be honest with you. Definitely would have liked that. Oh, we got an ion blast, though. That is going to replace our, our breach bomb right now. And let's get to this distress beacon and see what's going on over there. Are they just stressed? Who knows? Let's lead them to their destination. We got a quest marker in the sector. Look at that. Wow, how cool is that? Uh, we are going to jump over here, though, because we want to get a little bit more scrap before we go to that store. Uh, in case we... Whoa, you detect and retrieve an escape pod floating in your Let's pry it open. A rare survivor, once a calm, the survivor offers to join our crew for a time. Fantastic. I wonder how long that time is. Hopefully a long time. Uh, cool. Let's get to this distress beacon. The behorn of distress. We shall see. Disable defense system. Cool. We got 28 scrap. Uh, let's go see what's going on in this store. Who knows? Maybe it's something good. Uh, something that we could buy. I mean, it's potential. Uh, no, we could buy a crew member, but... Uh, you know, I don't think I really want to do that. I don't think I really want to. I do want to buy some fuel, though. And we'll buy some missiles, too. Just in case, you know, 
that's necessary. Um, we did kind of waste a bunch of scrap there, but, you know, it probably was worth it. I again apologize if that was loud. We're going to stay out of it because I don't want to deal with teleporters at all. Uh, but we are going to get to that quest beacon as quickly as possible, and then we can jump around a bit afterwards. Cool. So let's get the ion blast working there. We'll get the uh, dual laser firing at their weapons. And uh, we should take damage here, uh, but, you know, uh, minimal damage. Definitely minimal damage. The damage will be certainly minimized, uh, which is good. Okay. Yeah. Now, now we should succeed here. Uh, the ion blast and the dual lasers kind of kind of work well in unison with one another. I don't know why we didn't manage to take down their weapons, even though we did one damage. That guy must be like the fastest fucking repairman in the world, but you know, whatever. Um, and uh, I mean, I guess we should get with the anti biome beam. But I mean, getting three crew members at once is gonna be hard. Uh, okay, they're trying to escape. How do you see the entirety of the enemy ship while their while our sensors are down? I don't understand that. I do not get it. But whatever, it's fine. Uh, and we could get over here to jump to the quest beacon, which is what I want to do. Certainly. Okay, nothing going on at that beacon. That's kind of a bummer, to be honest with you. But uh, but that's fine. We can deal with it. Let's get to this quest beacon. We led them to their destination. They patch up our hole and show us their wares. Not exactly what I would have hoped for. Um, but again, we could buy some s fuel. Some fuel. Delicious fuel. Um, and then uh, we'll jump over here. You know, maybe maybe get to a few more beacons before we get out of here. Nothing going on at this beacon. I don't know. We're getting kind of, like, unlucky as far as, uh, like, beacon jumps are concerned. The past two videos, we just haven't really... Like, we get to a lot of beacons that, um, that do not give us anything, which kind of sucks. Uh, and let's go to Uncharted Nebula or Uncharted Nebula. Hmm, our choices are very, uh, versatile. We're gonna go to Uncharted Nebula. Uh, and try to jump to as many beacons as possible. We already jumped to two. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. There isn't even enough, uh, in this sector. But we could jump to most of them. Uh, so we're gonna try to do that. Great, nothing going on in there. It's a bummer. Uh, we are probably going to have to jump to that store, which also is a bummer because we don't want to buy it. Really? Really? I mean, I don't know. I, I don't know what to tell you guys. I, 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 can't, uh, I can't really do much if they don't give us anything, uh, to be honest with you. It, there's, there's not much that I can really do unless I'm getting things at the beacons. If I'm not getting anything at the beacon, then uh, I don't know. Okay, looks like we're gonna get into a fight here. We're definitely gonna power up that. Uh, and the dual laser is gonna be enough to deal with them. We are gonna take some damage here, which sucks, but, uh, you know, we can deal with it. Okay, firebomb. Let's get another guy in here to. Actually, let's get all three guys in here because this fire looks dangerous. Uh, we don't have to worry about our weapons going down so much. Their weapons are down, however, which means good stuff for us. Engines are online. Get you guys in here. Get you in the med bay. Uh, and then we'll consider powering that in just a moment. But likely they're not going to be firing at our med bay, even when they have the chance. Uh, you're our weapons guy, actually. You are our shields, fellow! Might as well get you in the engine room for now, because we're not going to be able to power up the weapons until after the fight anyway. Okay, we managed to hit them again. Uh, and uh, we should succeed here in just a moment. Uh, we are going to hit their pilot room in a second. I don't really care about dealing with the cloaking system, because, you know, I, really it's just a nuisance. It's not really going to be anything, any kind of factor that's really going to uh, kill us or anything like that. And we're just going to make sure that uh, we hit them. Because they shouldn't be able to dodge. I don't know how that works with the cloaking. Does it still give you 60% evasion? If uh, if your pilot room's down, I wonder. Okay, so let's get everybody in the med bay. Power down the dual laser. Power up the med bay. Because everybody kind of needs some healing. 
Uh, and Valeria, you shall be our shields lady once more. And Ohm shall get back into uh, the engine room. It doesn't really matter that we have a slug in the pilot room, uh, to be honest. It's not, it's not a, like a big deal. Um, we are jumping to this store just because we need to get to Nebula Beacons, by the way. As many as possible. Automated, wow, weapon pre-igniter would be awesome! Um, I don't know. I, I mean, <laughs> I kind of want to sell the anti-bio beam because I'm really not going to be using it. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to be using it. Even, like, getting three in a row is going to be really difficult. Uh, and we just don't have the kind of power or scrap to do that. So we're going to sell it. Um, and then we're going to get the automated reloader. And then we're going to try to save up our money so that we can, uh, you know, spend it on some upgrades for our ship. Because we are, like, kind of starved for upgrades here. Does that go places? Yeah, it does. Okay, cool. So let's go over, over here. Try to get to as many beacons as possible. Let's attack the pirate, because I kind of need to. Um, and uh, we are going to hit them in their shields when we get the chance. This is going to do a lot of damage to us, this fight, because they have a burst laser, a basic laser, and we're going to miss, which sucks. Um, great! Always go for the oxygen, eh? friends and we're just gonna keep missing oh there's fires in there really okay get get ye in there my friend I don't know where our lasers went just now by the way uh, they seem to have disappeared I don't see why they keep going for our 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 uh, oxygen I mean I suppose it's working out for them but okay we need to get you back in uh, engines we can power down our engines a bit get him healed up just a little bit uh, turn it on in a second so that we could get a little bit of dodge cool okay shields are down which we'll get two people in there to repair just so that gets moving ah I mean you know if we're gonna keep missing I don't know what to tell you okay shields are down no they're not okay now they're down okay now we could deal with that Med bay's down, not a big deal. We can deal with that later. There's a fire in the fucking med bay again. Really? Let's get everybody in there. Deal with the fires. Because we don't want to have to concern ourselves with fires. Okay, engines are down, so we'll get this guy back in here. And there's a fucking fire in there. You gotta be kidding me. You just got. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, so let's get one going there. Oh my god. Okay, let's get the med bay online. Okay, engines are completely down. I don't know what to tell you guys. I mean, I, I, I just, we're just not getting any kind of luck here. And there's no fire in the med bay at least, which is good. We can't jump out either. Which is, yeah, we're going to accept their offer. Why does that get to hit? That's bullshit. Okay, so there's a fire in the engine room. Uh... And a fire in the disco. We're going to deal with that the old-fashioned way. By suffocating the room of oxygen. Ah, oh, Jesus. We just are not having any luck with this run, to be honest. Um, sometimes that happens, I guess. Uh, you know, there's not much really else I could say. I don't know how we could see the weapon room, to be honest with you. I, d I don't understand why that is. Do slugs see, like, adjacent rooms? Oh, they do. Interesting. Okay, so we have to see... Okay, so we need a teleporter. I think that's the idea. I think I think that's what they're getting at by seeing the entire enemy room without our sensors online. We need a teleporter so that we can see their whole hull. And we need to teleport both of our slugs. Um, probably like a slug interceptor that doesn't have many rooms. Okay, I'm understanding. I'm getting to the understanding place. Um, we definitely want to upgrade our power uh, because... I want to power up this breach bomb because we're kind of needing it more and more as uh, as we progress here. Um, we are actually going to kind of get ahead of the rebel fleet just in case things get really dire. Okay. Okay, they're powering up their FTL drive. We could fire at their weapons, and I don't think their weapons can actually hit us. Uh, their beam probably can, but uh, that should be down before uh, we have to worry about it. Cool. 
We have a breach bomb ready as well in case we need it. But I don't think we do. No, we don't. And uh, this should be an easy fight. So that's good. Uh, they can't dodge either, which is nice. Weapons are down. And uh, success. And we get some scrap. This is nice. This is this is this feels good. This is this is a nice change of pace to the last fucking fight, uh, which was difficult as hell. Uh, and then we're gonna jump on this way, probably. Can this get down? No, it can't. Okay. It doesn't want to boogie that beacon, that bacon, that delicious, delicious bacon. Okay. So wow. All right. So we're definitely gonna need that. We're definitely gonna need that. Doing that kind of stuff. This is a dangerous fight. This is a very dangerous fight. Um, we could easily die here. So let's take care of that so that we don't have to worry about any of this stuff. Okay. Okay. Dealt with. We can turn off the uh, breach bomb for right now. Okay. We're definitely going to get their weapons again. Because the whole laser wall, it's not a big deal. Great. We're just going to miss every fucking shot again. Uh, how the enemy ship always has better evasion than, than everything on the planet, I just don't understand. But, you know, that's, uh, that's dice rolls for you, I guess. Where did our... Okay. Cool. Let's hit him in the weapons again. Make sure those go down. Let's hit him in the pilot room just so that I don't have to worry about this evasion nonsense anymore. Okay, they want to give us three fuel, five missiles, 13 scrap. That's pretty good, but, ha, ah, man, that, that's good. We need the fuel, we need the missiles. We'll take it. Um, and we have to get to 30 nebula beacons before sector 5 or sector 8? I don't know. Uh, let's chase them. Okay, looks like they got away. It's a bummer. We're going to jump over here, though. And just make it out on our coattails. Great, nothing at the beacon. That's fantastic. Just great to see. Um, attempt to follow and help them. Search is hopeless. Okay, well, um, we're going to have to jump to the exit because I think uh, either way we'd have to fight rebels, and I don't want to do that. Yeah, we would have. Okay, so let's jump to the Mantis-controlled sector. It isn't going to be fun. I'm not going to enjoy this one bit. Uh, but here we go. Let's uh, let's do this. And no nebulas again. Well, looks like we're not going to get any achievements on this run, <laughs> my friends. Uh, I suppose I could have done a better job of doing that, but uh, maybe in the future. Oh, good. Good, good, good. Okay, so let's get everybody in the med bay. And uh, then we're going to power up the med bay. And then what we're going to do is open up all the doors, except for the med bay doors. Uh, we're going to close that door as well. Close that as well. Uh, and they're going to try to get into the med bay, which is a smart move on their part. Um, and this is going to do two things for us. Uh, this is going to allow us to... You get in there. Uh, oh, no, no, we need to get a guy in the pilot room. He's taking damage, which is bad, but, you know, whatever. Okay, whoa, right, yeah, no oxygen in there. Yeah, let's close all the doors. Let's open all the doors. Let's close these doors. Actually, we're going to open them again, because I'm an idiot. But it's fine. We'll uh, close these doors. Actually, what are we? What are we thinking? Just close all the doors. Jump out. <laughs> I I am a fool, my friends. Okay. Did it still hit the fire? Uh, let's stay out of it for right now. Yeah, it still hit. Great. Cool. 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 Hopefully that goes out and we don't have to put put out the fire. Yeah, it does. Cool. And we'll let the oxygen ref refuel. That's the only reason that we didn't. Um, fight there by the way is because I, I don't I don't want to have to deal with borders while oxygen is down which may seem counterintuitive because it might be like a good reason to deal with borders while oxygen is down but um well you're probably right <laughs> I don't know what else to tell you uh anyway we shall jump on here and try to get to as many beacons as possible oh good asteroid field oh Level 3 shields! Huzzah, my friends! Huzzah! And a really powerful missile system as well. We don't have to worry about their, um... Their, their, uh, rock, their, uh, laser so much. We do have to concern ourselves with, uh... Oh, looks like they automatically healed up their thing. Oxygen's down again! What a funny joke! I've never heard it before. Can you tell me again? 
Wow. How do they keep getting their goddamn shields online? I have hit three... Oh, this motherfucker. I've had four... I Four bombs in there. Still doing nothing, huh? Still nothing. Okay. Should be enough. Nope. Still not enough because I can't seem to fucking hit them. Okay. Their weapons are offline. Their shields are down. Thankfully an asteroid hit their shields. Now we can hit them in the pilot room, which the asteroid already did for us. Cool. It all kind of worked out. Cool. Uh, by the way, a good tip in case you're playing by yourself, I could just sit here and wait for a lot of these asteroids to miss if I wanted to power up uh, Ohm a lot in his engine uh, job for dodging. However, I am not going to do that because that would be very boring. Uh, and we're going to jump over here. I didn't realize that that jump couldn't jump to that jump. Jump, jump, jump. Jump, 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 jump. Uh, we're going to attempt to remain concealed. Again, I don't want to deal with borders at all. I just don't like fighting him. Uh, and especially right now, uh, we are not looking good. Let's, uh, let's give him the fuel. We don't have a lot of fuel, and they gave us 45 scrap. Okay, good. Because then we can... Ah, no! Boners. Okay, so... Question is, what do we do here? Um, do we upgrade our weapon systems? Or do we upgrade... I, I think we're going to save for shields. Uh, to be honest, I think that is our best bet. Uh, in truth. Because uh, we'll be able to, you know, do some stuff. We also need money to repair as well if we get that opportunity. Nothing at that beacon, which sucks. Which, I'm, you know, I'm being a little bit counterintuitive. Ah, fuck it. We're going to aid the civilian ship. Here we go. Because I was about to say... Uh, I'm being kind of uh, counter to what I was saying myself, which was that, uh... Why is two going there? Let's get the two going there. And let's get you going here. Uh, because I was saying that, um... Okay, one level of weapons is down. <laughs> Great! Fire in the oxygen room! Haha, ha, game. Funny jokes that you make. I like them. They're clever. Um, let's go ahead and open that. So that we suffocate them a bit. Good. Breach Brom. Breach Brom. Breach Brom doing good work. Again, these are continuously opening and closing. Close that and stop them from taking out our sensors. It's not a big deal if they do, to be honest, but, um, uh, you know. Okay, so these guys should be suffocated. And we. No more life signs on the pirate ship. Cool. We killed everyone. Cool, and they patched up our hull damage. That's very nice of them to do. Uh, we'll let our oxygen refill just a bit, and then we'll get uh, people... Actually, we'll get everybody in the... Uh, or these guys, at least, in the med bay uh, to heal them up, because we kind of need some healing done. And uh, it's definitely a good idea to get into every jump with full health. I think, at least. Cool. Uh, we have enough for three levels of shield, so we're going to take it, just so that I don't have to make the decision later of whether or not I want to buy shields or buy uh, repairs. Uh, and fuel and stuff, so great. Okay, actually, you know what? This isn't as bad because um, we can. Uh, it's not as bad because uh, we don't have to worry so much about uh, teleporters, which is nice. Okay, weapons are down, kinda. Oh, oh, a Mark Three. Good! Very good! I'm gonna keep fucking with them in there. Just a bit. It's a little bit of a waste of, uh, of, uh, you know, uh, missiles, but it's also not, because then we just don't have to deal with them. Uh, so, you know. I think it's not a bad idea right now! Somebody's trying to repair their weapons, but that's not a huge concern, to be totally honest with you. Considering that, um, even if they get one level up, uh, it's not really gonna do much for them. To be, uh, totally truthful. Uh, they're gonna need to get more than one level up. They're gonna need to get at least orange in order to do so. 
Um, but it's fine. We'll just keep hitting them in their shields, which we can't seem to take down. Maybe eventually. Cool. Now they're dead. And you're dead. Do you see? Do you see? Um, we're probably not going to be able to make it to the exit if we go the other way. So let's go to the store. See what's going on there. Crew teleporter, drone control. You know, valuable options. But we're just going to get some fuel. We're going to get as many missiles as possible, which is one. And uh, get back to full health, which is what we did. Can that jump to the exit? No, it can't. All right, well, we're going to have to jump right to the exit. We probably could have made it to one more beacon before we left, but um, eh, they give us some extra stuff. That's nice. No, we couldn't have. All right, um, and let's get to the Uncharted Nebula, which is Sector 4, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, in which case, we still have a chance. We still have a bit of a chance. Is this, no, this is Sector 5, so we had to get there before Sector 5, I think. So I don't think we made the, uh, the old... Um, we gave it the old college try, boys, but it didn't really work out. Uh, which sucks. But, you know, it happens. Uh, sell... Ugh, God, no. I'm not gonna sell any amount of missiles, because we kinda need them to do anything. And the breach missiles do not do very much damage at all. Great. Nothing going on in that beacon. I'm gonna explore as many, uh, nebula beacons as possible, of course, as well, because, uh... You know, I, I don't... Oh, God. Sultan shields. Great. Oh, Jesus. They have lots of guns. They have lots and lots of guns. Okay, so... Our bomb is ready. That's gonna hurt. Oh, thank God it missed. Oh, thank God it missed. Okay, yep. Lots of pain going on in here. Let's get you in there. Okay, let's get the... Well, the breach bomb's down, so never mind. Um... Definitely want to get them at the shields. Okay, get you in here. Hopefully there are no more fires. Breach bomb's ready to go. Uh, this is gonna hurt. Okay. Let's get you guys in here. Valyria back in shields. We're gonna keep the breach bomb going. That's gonna hurt. So we're gonna help him. Last breach bomb that we're going to use, for at least right now. Okay, we're keeping their weapons offline, which is exactly what we need to do. You need to get back in shields, however. Valyria! Valyria! You need to be dealt with, my friend! Uh, and, uh, yeah, it looks like they're trying to escape. Well, that's a funny joke, because you guys seem to just keep wanna fighting, but you're not trying to fight. Uh, we're gonna use a breach bomb there. Okay. They wanna give us two fuel, three missiles, and twenty scrap. Nope. You guys are dead. Because you gave me such a goddamn hassle, you're fucking dead. I hope you enjoy your death, you pieces of garbage. And just to add insult to injury, we're gonna hit them in their oxygen. I don't even know if these guys actually took out our oxygen, but I know that I hate them. Uh, and that's what's important to me. And we're going to power down our med bay, power up the med bay. Uh, which doesn't make any sense at all. But that's fine! Uh, because, you know, sense is not something that we do on the USS Scrotum Doom. That's not, that's not how it's done here, my friends. Uh, we don't, we don't do sense. Sense is for the weak. We're not sensical people. Okay, Ion Storm issue uh i think we could take this fight mm. we'd have to lower our shields ha huh. i don't know probably not let's let's uh let's leave uh because we'd have to lower our shields and then that beam would fire and we just kind of have to hope that we could get out before they get out um so anyway let's power up our engines and get on out of here and giddy up on out of here, my friends. We'll see what's going on uh, over here. Let's attack the ship. Let's kick its ass. Uh, let's get all of our power back, though. Okay, breach bomb there. You there. You there. Oh, and they teleported to us. Huzzah, my friends. Huzzah. Um.
Okay, looks like we're going to take a fight in here. Okay, we're going to close the doors, and we're going to get you into shields to repair that. Actually, we're going to get you into shields to repair that, and you got to get back in here. Just so that we can dodge. Oh, fucking piece of garbage. <sighs> Does everybody have a goddamn breach a firebomb of doom? Like, it feels like they do. Oh, God. Okay, sensors are down. Not a big deal. There's a fire in the engine room. That's, again, reasonable and dealable with. Uh, we definitely do need to have everything up. And we killed them all. Okay. So success has been had. Uh, kinda. You can get in there and pair our sensors. Because you're not doing anything, Declan. Um, everybody's almost dead as well. God, we are just... It, we're not getting great stuff, I'll tell you. I really don't think we're getting particularly lucky in the way of uh, upgrades. And Valyria kind of needs some healing too, so why don't you get back in there. She needs some tender loving as well. Uh, and get everybody back into where they need to be. Cool. Get our shields up. Um, we could start considering uh, getting engine upgrades. But I'm going to keep our money just in case we find anything else. God damn it. A store. Okay, we're going to get to the store. We're going to see what's in there. Uh, we need fuel. We need a bunch of stuff. Uh, reverse ion field. Reasonable. Nah, advanced FTL navigation. Not that great. Uh... And I'm going to get yelled at for that. But I, I don't like it. I don't like jumping to any beacon that I want to go to. Because if you play like me, any beacon that I've already been to is already sucked up by the Rebels. I play as close to the Rebels as possible. Uh, just so that I could get to as many beacons as possible. But anyway, let's uh, let's repair. Let's get some fuel. Let's get as many missiles as we need, uh, which is a lot. And basically try to stay ahead of the curve here. Um, we're not really spending to... Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Okay. Let's, uh, let's go there. Let's get another breach bomb going there, and let's get that going. It's, uh, great. We're just missing everything as well, which is especially nice. Weapons are down, so there goes the breach bomb and the, uh, ion blast, which means we can't hit them. Which means I might as well power this down until we get the ion blast up. There we go. Cool. Okay, we took some damage there is a shame. Okay, Ion Blast is up, which means we could hit him there, and then we could hit him there, or we should... Okay, fire in the doors room, fire in the pilot room, fire in the disco, fire in the Taco Bell. Okay, we could get the Breach Bomb up again. You know what? We're gonna hit him in there fucking... Actually, we're gonna hit him here. Okay, our shields are down. Uh, let's get you in here to help repair these shields. Actually, that's not necessary. We do need help in there, though. Or maybe we do... No, nope, we don't. We don't need any help there. Jesus fucking Christ. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you guys, really. Um, we're going to fire another up there. We're going to miss, which is great. Um, and we just could die here, to be honest. Uh, which would suck. But I don't know what else we can do. Uh, we can get our doors online. That's going to be necessary. Cool. Okay, uh, hull breach, which, you know, sucks, but we can deal with it, I guess. Um, we can jump out. Where can we jump to? We can jump to another store. All right, fuck it. We're doing it. We're trying to stay alive. I don't know, man. I <laughs> we, we just had full health, by the way, uh, just to remind you of that, and we'll repair as much as we goddamn can. Like, we literally just had full health. But no doesn't matter. We get in the med bay. Uh, and you get prepared to get in the med bay as well. Ugh. We just had full health and we almost died. I, you know, we, we just, uh, we're not getting particularly lucky on this run. Uh, to be honest. Let's get Valyria in there. Let's get you back in weapons, I think, right? Yeah. Okay. Um... Good thing I didn't fucking spend my money on engines, right? Because then I wouldn't have had the money to uh, repair. Although maybe that's kind of uh, retroactive. How do they have three goddamn shields? Okay. Oh, good. They only have two shields. Um, 
Well, oxygen needs to stay up. I guess, yeah. Fuck it. Let's do it. Oh, shit. And they have drones up, too? How much fucking power do they have? Hey, okay, medbay's down. I'm taking more damage. Okay. Breach is going. Oh, they teleported to. Uh, oh, they had a. a oh. Okay, yeah, I don't know. They have the most fucking power in a goddamn ion storm. Most that I've ever goddamn seen, ever. Oh, and look, a hole blast. Good. No, that's cool. We didn't need any of that. Oh, our engines are down. Well, let's put our engines up so that we can teleport out. I didn't even notice that. Uh, and we can't close those doors either. We can open all our doors, though. Uh, you get in there to deal with that. We have to deal with this fucking monster of a man in just a second. We're trying to jump out, to be honest. Okay, get these guys in here. I'd like to repair our weapons, which I'll do with him. There we go. Oh, they're trying to get away. Really? That's a funny joke. Uh, and they have three levels of shields, which is great. So there's nothing that we can do about that. We can power up our med bay. There's really no sense in having the dual laser online, so let's power up the breach missile, and then we can power up the dual laser. And they pieced it! Oh! That's a funny fucking joke. Okay. Let's get you guys in here and repair the weapons as fast as possible. Then we'll get them healed up. I don't know. I don't know what we could have done, really, to make this uh, work better. But uh, nothing that I know of. Nothing that I know of at all. We'll go to this other beacon. Man, 30 nebula beacons. That's that's a lot. There's nothing at this beacon. Power that down. We have one scrap. And we're going to have to jump to the exit. Um, we don't have any fuel. We don't have... We've been buying fuel every time we go to a shop, too. Okay, Rock Home Worlds. Uh, we should die fairly shortly here, I think, to be honest. I don't, uh, we didn't get any weapons, we didn't get any, uh, anything, really. Uh, you know, I think it all just kind of comes down to when you don't get any, what, is there fighting in a room? Why is there fighting in a room? Who's fighting? Oh, he's not fighting, he's just there, okay. That's, alright. Well, you should probably change up what that's called. I'm just saying. Okay. Um, we're gonna take lots of damage, in fact, we're probably gonna die here. <laughs> Especially when we miss our first breach bomb. Uh, and they have missiles. And there's a solar flare. Um, that's definitely not a good sign. Okay. Uh, let's let the fire hit wherever it's going to hit. Hopefully it doesn't do damage. Okay. <laughs> hit us right in our oxygen room. Uh, we didn't need the oxygen to be online or anything. I, You know, we this. I'm going to name this episode fucking oxygen. Because... Um, it doesn't look like we're getting any luck with having any goddamn oxygen. We're using all the breach bombs. I don't give a shit. We're trying to live. Uh, and I turned them off just now. Good, another fire. Which is especially good when there's already a fire. Uh, so we're going to open up this door. And we're going to jump away, probably. Yeah... Probably, yeah, we should. I mean, they have fires as well. Who's Who's got low health? Oh, you've got low health. Okay, well, yeah, our weapons are down. We're just going to jump out. Uh, as much as I don't want to do that, but uh, we're trying to live. Oh, good. Zero fuel, and uh, I believe... Oh, and they teleported immediately. Without a teleporter. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, guys. <laughs> we have no weapons either. Uh, and we can't jump because we have no fuel. So, um, this is going to be the end for the USS Scrotum of Doom. Uh, we're not going to let them have their hands on us. We're going we're gonna to kill ourselves is what's going to happen right now. None of this nonsense. They get to kill us. Is there, is there a chance that we could win here? No, there's not. <laughs> there's no chance. I mean, maybe there is. Oh, well, never mind. Uh, yeah, we're dead. Let's let's let it happen. We went out gracefully, guys. We went out gracefully. They didn't. Oh, they did get to destroy our ship. 
That's a bummer. Well, the Scrotum of Doom, at least we did it uh, as well as we could have. I don't really like the Slug Cruiser that much. I mean, like, look. Beacons explored 66, ships defeated 14. We got 14 out of 66 beacons. We did, um, we did skip, I think, three, uh, and, uh, and dodged, like, two. Uh, so, I mean, you know, there, there is, there is that. But still, I mean, that's, that's a third of the beacons explored, so we're not getting much scrap. I mean, by, by six sectors, we have 550 scrap. That's, like, nothing. Uh, and only four crew. I don't know. I, I you know, I think, I think we just got unlucky. Um, 30 nebula before sector eight. Okay. So that, that was actually, that, that's kind of doable if we get lucky on the nebula stuff. Uh, yeah. And I don't know about that. Maybe I should use the bio beam more. Maybe, maybe that was my, maybe that was my issue is that I wasn't using the bio beam and the ship is just designed around that bio beam because it probably is. Um, but they just don't give you the kind of power to use it immediately. Hmm. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, I'll probably try again. I'm sorry for not using the bio beam. I know that that's probably going to get. Uh, I'm gonna probably going to get yelled at for that. Uh, but uh, maybe we'll try again in the next episode. Uh, let me know what you think. Let me know if you want to see the slug ship again. See if I can do it better this time, um, or next time rather. So uh, yeah, let me know. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Uh, and this is Alpaca Patrol signing out. Peace, fools. <laughs>